it's Stars here, and today I'm extremely excited because we're going to be reviewing my very first oh this is heavy pushing box! Yay! Um, I've been eyeing this box for a while. I've seen previous um review like previous past box reviews on this, especially from um our pushing addiction. I will leave that channel. Uh, down below for lots of pushing goodness, but I got one. So yeah, I can't wait to see what's inside. They do do spoilers like other box, like other subscription boxes, like So Kawaii. Uh, one of the items that I did see was a sweater. Now, now about that. Um, about that. There's the sticker here. Um, that says extra small. I'm not an extra small. I don't want to put my size out there, but I can definitely tell you that I'm not an extra small. Even if you look at like the build of my body, you can tell I am not an extra small. So I'm hoping that they just misstickered it and that the tag on the inside says, you know, my size. Um, otherwise, I will have to contact customer care. But let's get into the let's get into the review so first up we have the box so there's Pusheen with her eyes closed and then it has like her tail and her little paws so let's go ahead and open it and see if I can scoot back so you can you can't really see it anyway sorry I tried okay <gasps> Oh, oh no, no, look, it opened it and it looks amazing already. So, while I'm opening this, oh, it's so pretty. So, Pusheen box is a seasonal box. So there's, you know, fall, winter, spring, and summer. So this box is the fall box. I believe they are taking orders for the winter box, which the theme is going to be uh, 10th anniversary. So here's the little art for that. I don't have a coupon for this or any like affiliate thing, but I will leave the link in the description down below. Um, fair warning for those who are buying it. So I got really confused because the state I live in, I live in Delaware, right? And so I, when it, I got shipping information, I was like, oh, it's coming from New York. Okay, it should get here pretty fast. But then I was, you know, I'm, I'm a stalker when it comes to my subscription boxes. So I was I check tracking, and tracking said California. I said, why, why did it go? Why, why was it here? And then why did it go all the way over here? And does it make sense? And so I kept trying to see if there was something wrong because it ended up in Arizona and it ended up in New Mexico. And I was like, okay, I need to contact Culture Fly, which are the people who uh, made the pushing box. They're behind the whole thing. So I did that and the information that I got that I'm going to share with you guys is that their labels are created in New York, but the boxes themselves ship out from a warehouse in California. So when, when you get that stinking FedEx thing that says from New York and you know, you're pretty close and you're, and you're like me who's pretty close to New York. Please don't get too excited like I did and then get mad and disappointed when, like, you know, your tracking gets delayed or something because it's coming from a warehouse in California. So there you go, information for you guys. So, um, let's get into it. I think this is the information card. I have my hand covering the back. So this is what, well, this is what the, um, card looks like. And here is the box with its contents. Oh my. So here's this. Let's go ahead and get into the very first item. I don't know what to pull out. I really don't. There's a lot of big stuff in here. The box was pretty heavy. So I'm gonna go ahead and pick this. Oh, I don't know what that is. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and pick this out. Um, out of this world. I think that was the theme for fall. So out of this world, and we seem to have a little pillowcase. Oh yeah, 
by the way, all this stuff in this box is Pusheen Box exclusive. So whatever you get in this box, you can go out and buy it uh, at stores. Um, you can you can try your luck with eBay or even like Mercari, but you better be willing to uh, huh, cough up some dough because people really, really like price this stuff high. Like I've seen people like reselling these boxes on open for 135. Crazy. Anyway, pillowcase. <laughs> Flip that off. Oh, is it for king size? I need a king size pillow. Oh, it's not, but there's two. Okay, wait a second. Oh, wow. That's so pretty. So this is, I don't know, can you guys see it? Hello. So this is what it looks like. It's um a satin pillowcase. It's gonna make me hot, but it's good for hair. It's good for my hair, so. Cute, cute, cute. I love that. And then, does the other one have a different design? No. So they have, it's two of the same design. So there you go. Does it say what size pillow? No. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and assume maybe this is like a queen or king size pillow. I know that that definitely won't fit my pillow. That is huge. Okay. Um. Yeah. All right. Let's see. Um. Oh, I see the sweater. Let me go ahead and check and see if it's my size. Please be my size. Please be my size. Please. Please. Where's the tag? Please be my size. No. Okay, so it's not my size, so I'm gonna have to take a picture of that and message customer care. Oh. Well, that's sad, but I will, I will show you guys. It's a honey! It's a honey! Oh my gosh, it's a honey! I love hoodies! Oh gosh, this, this is so small. I wish I was extra small. So here's the um, hoodie. It is crushed velvet. This is not as bad as I thought it was going to be because I don't really care for crushed velvet. But this is like a nice crushed velvet. Not like a crusty crushed velvet. You, you get what I'm saying? Yeah. So it says cosmic on it. And then there's Pusheen on the moon. And then it has a hood. Um, there's no designs on the sleeve or on the back. It's just blank. But this is a really, really nice sweater. Perfect for fall because it is getting cold well not over here it's been like 70 degrees where i am <sighs> yeah don't judge my folding skills but i'm pretty sad that i have to contact them all right but let's still let's keep getting into the an alarm clock an alarm clock and i subscribe wow this is really cute so here is the alarm clock and I, just, I don't know if you guys can see, I know, I have my ring light on, you can see that. Um, the alarm clock has each of the zodiac symbols. So, yeah, stellar at the top, that's cute. Go ahead and, is it taped? I don't like tape. Okay, open this up. And then it comes with the, you know, little instruction manual oh this is so cute it's such a nice size too yuck alarms I wonder what noise does it make does it make like a ringing sound or I don't know I'll have to just have batteries in. yeah so batteries are not in here it takes one double A um, maybe I'll re record the sound of the alarm going off and then I will um, put it in here so this is the part where I would edit in the okay, sound. guys so I have some I have a battery I have a battery for the alarm clock let's just see how much way it goes whoops Stars doesn't know how to put batteries in, apparently. Okay. 
So, oh gosh. Put this back. Okay, I'm gonna turn it. That's annoying. <laughs> but, here we go. The clock is now working. No, I don't have it at the correct time. I gotta fix it. But it's not the correct time, so I'm gonna have to fix the time, but there is the alarm clock. There was the noise that it made. So there you guys go. You can see all the um, zodiac symbols. I am Aquarius. So there's mine right there. Um, let me know which one yours is in the comments down below. Oh, 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 focus, focus. That is really cute. Oh, that's so adorable. That's really nice. Okay, let me put the, I'm just looking back and forth. Let me put this back in here. Oh my gosh, I love this so far. Um, I'm not getting into the big stuff yet, because you know that's like, you know, crazy. Okay, what's this? <gasps> A coaster set, I love coasters, yes. Oh, this is so cute. So here's what the box art looks like. There's tape on it. Don't like tape, so tape is gonna have to go away. Goodbye, tape. Okay, open this. Ooh. Yeah, so just like your regular coaster. So on the back, it has the Pusheen Box logo. So we have one that says Stellar. We have one that says Stardust. I love her face. That's a good face. This one that says Stardust. We have one with Pusheen on the moon. And then we have one with the theme, which is out of this world. This box seems like it's out of this world. Definitely seems like it's out of this world. Okay, uh, next. Oh, look at this. So it's a sleep mask. I was just saying how I needed to buy a sleep mask. Um, so <laughs> the mask says Stellar on it. Go ahead. And, and now I can't see. This is what I look like without my glasses on. Do I look, do I look beautiful? Of course I do. So just kind of put that on. Can you see? I can't, I, it's an eye mask. I can't see anything. So I don't know if I'm in camera frame, but this is <laughs> this is what it looks like. Okay. That's so cute. Oh my gosh. Adorable. Oh my trash on the side. Okay, there's something here at the bottom. That looks like a really big item. So let's get into the stuff in the actual box. Out, okay, it just says out of this world. Oh, it's a trinket jar. That's cute. So here's a little trinket jar. And then it has the whole out of this world. Stellar, is it upside down? No, Stellar. Go ahead and open this. I love these boxes. Honestly, I really don't want to throw them away, but I have to. So, wow. wow, 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 wow. This is so cute. Nice plastic material and a nice yellow lid to kind of resemble the stars. You kind of just put that on there. So here you go. This is so cute. I love this trinket jar. Uh, I might put hair clips in here or hair ties. Maybe. I don't know. Well, at least I have an idea of what I want to put in there. Okay. Uh, let's go for this box. No way. No way. No way. No way. We have a star projector lamp. A star projector lamp. A. Wow. 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 I didn't show the box. I'm just so excited to get into it. I love these things. These are great. I used to have one when I was small and it broke and I was sad. But. Yeah, I also, I, also, I also used to have those um glow-in-the-dark stars on my ceiling. Yeah. Oh my gosh! 
Oh, I should put the trinket drawer back. But here we go. Here it oh it rotates. Okay, so it, it rotates. Um I don't know if you guys can see the designs very well. There's a bit of a glare. But I can show you guys the top that says Stardust. And then there's a button for LED. And then there's a button for star. So I'm not sure exactly what that means. Um, I will have to record again later tonight when it gets dark so I can show you guys the lamp. But that's so cool! Oh my gosh! Okay, so batteries are in. I'm not going to close it up just yet, but I'm going to turn this on. <gasps> Ooh, okay, so now you can see the designs a whole lot better now that the light is on. Oh, LED makes it flash. I thought it would rotate. I guess it doesn't rotate. Unless it's supposed to, and mine's just broken, I don't know. But, there you go. Let's see what it looks like with the lights out. Close the door. Turn the light off. And now it's dark, except for my mom on her phone. Say hi! <laughs> so, um, here we go. Three, two, one. <gasps> oh my gosh! Wow, <gasps> look at this. Oh, you can't really see it, but uh, I don't know if you guys can see it, but it says Stardust and like my whole, and the whole entire room is covered in like stars and machine constellations and things like that. This is really cute. So I'm gonna turn this star part off and I'm gonna turn the LED on. So, the LED, uh, seizure warning, by the way, LED just makes it kind of flash everywhere, the top part, make it flash everywhere. So then if we turn that off, and then we turn them both on, it just kind of looks weird. Yeah, I don't like that. I like it. I, I just, no, I just like this part. That's so cool. Where would I put this to make it... Well, it doesn't look nice now, but there you go. There's that. That's so cute! I love it! Next. Ooh, what is this? I'm a vinyl figure! That's right. So from the reviews I've seen, every single Pusheen box comes with an exclusive vinyl figure. Or plushie. Yeah. So, the box is a little crushed. It's okay. I'm not gonna really keep it. But it's a moon pl a moon moon plushie, uh, a moon vinyl figure. Now, if you are the kind of collector who likes to keep their stuff in the box, this is a beautiful box to do it in. But I'm not that kind of collector, so I'm gonna take it out of the box. Eh, this does not smell good. But it's cute. It just doesn't smell good. This thing is heavy. It's pretty big, actually. So. Move that back. One side, second side. Okay. Wow. Big. Big sheen. So here's the moon figure. It comes on this little plate. Um you I feel like you can take it off, but I would not recommend. You can't take pushing off. You can take the whole moon thing off. Because there's like a little thing at the bottom. But here is the figure. Pusheen is on the moon. And it comes on this little plate. So, uh, where am I going to put this? My bookshelf is crowded. Okay, well, I will definitely have to figure that out. Definitely. For now, I'm going to put this back, back, S -s stay. I'm going to put this back in the box. If I, if I can, 
Okay, here we go. Wow, wow, wow. Okay, so the last item in the box is a hanging wall art. Ooh, yay. I have a spot for it too. And there's um, instructions and stuff. Remove sticks and oh, it's like a string thing. Okay, uh, do I really want to open this? Cause I don't know if I'll be able to close it. But I don't know if you guys can. There. <laughs> so I made space so you guys can see what it's supposed to look like. Maybe I will make like a short like um, video. Um on Instagram or maybe if I decide to do this today there will definitely be a clip inserted with that okay so that was everything inside the pusheen box for fall here's what the inside looks like I love this box I really don't want to get rid of it because it's like wow I love it storage storage if there's a box that you really don't want to get rid of and you're running out of storage this will definitely do. It's pretty big too, so. All right, so. Um, yeah, so here is the card. This is what the card looks like. There are short little blurbs for each one. So, let's see. Well, what did I do with the sweater? Oh, I put it over here. So let's see the sweater, which is not in my size, which I'm kind of sad about. But here's the here's the cosmic sweater again. Ta-da! Uh, it says you'll be over the moon for this comfy hoodie with the pushy cosmic graphic. So yeah, um, depending on what they tell me to do with this sweater, I might put it for sale on my Mercari page, so I'll, I'll, I guess I'll link it down below, I guess. This is a size extra small, so if you are a size extra small, this will work. I want to say, is it, um, ooh, polyester, okay, yeah, but it's, just, it's an extra small, so it has a hoodie and stuff, so there you go. I haven't really decided. It has pockets. Hold on. Hold on. Freeze. 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 I didn't notice this. Pockets. Pusheen. Box. Culture. Fly. You have just made me so happy by putting real pockets on your hoodie. Thank you. If you are watching, if someone over there is watching this video, first of all, thanks for watching. Second of all, wow, keep putting more pockets on your stuff, and I might just subscribe to the annual plan, honestly. Um, but yeah, there's the sweater. Fold this back up. Put that to the side. Okay. Um, next we have the the eye mask. This satin sleep mask is perfect for a relaxing cat nap. Ooh. So, okay. So, I feel like these blurbs are a lot... They're shorter and smaller than the ones for, like, So Kawaii or Kawaii Box when I did those. So, I feel like this would be a good one to, like, uh, pick the item out of the box, see what it is, and then read it but then that would that would you know induce spoilers because you can't really bend it i don't really want to bend it cuz 